So it's just come to light almost a month after the Secure 2.0 bill that went in force that there was actually an error in the document that as it currently stands actually eliminates everyone's ability to make catch up contributions inside the retirement plan starting in 2024. So what Congress intended was to make an early retirement provision for people in the early 60s to be putting away more money. And they had a special rule where if you earn so much money, it had to be done on a Roth basis. But when they're putting the bill together, they're deleting paragraphs. And it looks like they deleted a certain key paragraph that made it possible for people to do any type of contributions. Now, this is just discovered by someone at the American Retirement Association. So it took about a month to catch this error. Now, could there be more errors in the plan? There certainly could be. Like when most of these big bills come through, oftentimes they have unintended consequences. This is just a good example of that. Now, the good news here is we caught it early. There's still 11 months before 2024. We could make a simple change and get everything corrected. However, the bad news is we only have 11 months. Congress usually doesn't make little technical bills that could simply fix these things. It's really rare for them to put that kind of thing through. So we kind of have to just wait and see if this is something they're going to fix this year. Now, the IRS is still unclear if they have the authority to interpret the rules to continue allowing people to do, because the bill actually does state that no one is allowed to make up a catch-up contribution, whether it be pre-tax or Roth, in 2024. So this is just one key developing issues that I'm going to keep you guys posted on so, so you guys know what to expect coming into next year. So this content is something you find helpful. Make sure to give it a like and subscribe to you so you can stay up to date on issues like this. If you want to keep up to date more, there, my email subscription is in the bottom below that you can sign up for. You get weekly emails on all things Washington Retirement, as well as key updates from national news that affect your financial situation. Now, if you want a more in-depth video on the Secure Act 2.0 and how it affects Washington State retirement, I have a detailed video that you can find in the description below. I'll see you guys all next week. Remember that your future depends what you do today.